What's going on there guys? Today we're talking the sumo deadlift. So we've already got another tutorial video on a conventional deadlift. So please, if you haven't seen that, go and watch that one first. Everything pretty much in terms of your position for your upper body is going to be exactly the same with the arms and everything like that. So what's the first thing that comes to mind when you hear the word sumo is sumo wrestlers and they do all this wide stance stuff, okay? So that's why it's called that, it's a sumo stance. We're gonna come really, really wide, right up to the bar, and toes are turned out about 45 degrees. Now keep in mind, for this movement, your knees should only go where your toes point. So they go out when you come down, and they come back in. They never cross to the middle, and they never come out too far, just straight where the toes go. We're gonna sit down really low, just like we're sitting into a chair. Hands come inside your knees at shoulder width, and we're gonna turn the insides of your elbows forward, Keep your shoulder blades nice and tight, and then from there, stand all the way up, lock out, squeeze your shoulder blades, tense your legs, tense your bum, and back down to the ground. I'm gonna show you three or four reps here, just for demonstration. Make sure your head is always up. If you look at the floor, your back is gonna round over with your eyes. Okay, ready? Up we go. And that's your sumo deadlift there, guys. Fantastic glute developer and also an overall body strength developer. So if your focus is on getting some bit more glute and leg strength, do sumo. If it's all over strength, do the conventional deadlift. See you in the next one, guys. Thank you very much.